Wrestle Story. Wrestle Story. Not yeah. to be confused with Wrestle Quest. No, which we haven't even played at this point. No, no, we haven't. No. Uh, but Wrestle Story was announced the Thursday before, or the Wednesday before PAX started. Uh, or maybe Thursday. I, I thought it was day. Thursday, like the day, starting day of PAX. Yeah, and so it is a new wrestling based mm-hmm. RPG yeah. with turn based active combat. Mm-hmm. Uh, so it has a lot of similarities. But the art style is completely different. Art right? style is very different, yep. And also they're not going for uh, a realistic wrestling. You're not going to see any Randy Savages in Wrestle Story. These are all custom characters. It's more about the idea of wrestling entertainment as a sport and using that as a backdrop for this world that they've created. Uh, it's very lovingly created as someone who's a, a recent wrestling fan, but a fan of wrestling. Yeah. Uh, I had a smile on my face the whole time while I was playing that 20-minute demo. Uh, I think the, the, the dev team's love for wrestling really shines through in their writing, and, and they, they just uh, nail the vibes for yeah. a wrestling game. Yeah, yeah uh, again, whenever you first start out, you're a brand new wrestler, and the course of the game, you take on uh, more and more elite wrestlers, mm-hmm. not to be confused with like elite wrestling, but uh, <laughs> these are just like stronger wrestlers in the US. Right. And so you start off completely fresh, and they yeah. immediately say, like, you're from Jobberville. You're from Jobberville, right. yeah. <laughs> they're, they're understanding, you know, they understand what um, people mm-hmm. that are big fans of wrestling want to hear and see. Yeah. Uh, and again, it's just sort of like, you know, it's fun. It's yeah. just a good time. Yeah, like uh, the, the passion of the dev, t- uh, dev team really shines through. You know, the opening intro cut scene talks about how there's these five regions run by the baby faces, but one day the heels took over. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and it's just, it's very wrestling. It oozes love, and I'm really excited to get my hands on that one. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I think as far as like between the two of them, uh, this one is very approachable for someone like me who's not super into wrestling. Yeah. It's kind of like that first step into mm-hmm. this world uh, rather than... Uh, WrestleQuest has sort of like a very large um, and very faithful sort of like look at the world of wrestling in terms of its history. Yeah. And I'm not going to understand almost any of those rights. Right. right. Like this, I can kind of, I can make do with the world that they created because it is just for this game. Right. Yeah. Yeah. It, 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 there's no deeper connection to wrestling in the sense that, like, you're not going to see, you know, Randy Savage or Hulk Hogan or, or any of the big names from wrestling. Those are, like, the biggest names. Like, you're not going to see HBK or you're not going to see yeah. any of the, the, the wrestlers who made wrestling what it is today over the last 30 years in WrestleStory. You're going to make your own wrestler yeah. and and make your own stamp in the wrestling world in this game. And that we hear, I think, was 2023. Yeah. Um, that does sound right. I think they were aiming for this year. Yeah. I think it's they're aiming for this year, but they're still hunting for a publisher. They don't have a publisher right. nailed down 100% yet, but they, they do want to get it out this year. Yeah, so be on the lookout for it. I think uh, we're going to be seeing a lot more hype as that sort of stands on its own. Mm-hmm. realize like, how different it is. Yeah, setting itself apart from WrestleQuest. Yeah. Yeah.